Uh, honestly, I probably take all of this. Like, I like the pear and the beetle is just a good thing. I haven't really looked in what... <laughs> I don't really know what else is in the pack because I didn't look very hard, but we'll get there. All right, let's be the subtle step family and then have a tiny look here, maybe. Try to shark Spinosaurus and Mantis build today. Really fun. Wait, it's got they got shark Mantis again? Oh, not in here, but okay. <laughs> I do want to try that, like a proper one. Because I've only tried it a couple of times in like dying weekly packs. And yeah, I should try harder, I think. Going <laughs> to going live note. It was definitely different to my normal ones. <laughs> Alright. Uh I don't think I want the rest of this. Like I'm I'm starting to come around on the idea that frog is actually pretty cool, but I don't think I take it. I think I combine these. Yeah, no, I, I definitely combine these and then let these be at the front. The only reason why I'm not combining these is because it doesn't make it that much stronger, and it's even more annoying to sell it. <laughs> at least I know I can sell them individually if I find a load of stuff I like. All right, there are no pills. I may take uh, I may take a spider anyway, but Ooh, love that. Uh, let's see, what else could I go for here? I do like peacocks. I'm not really seeing much else, but we could definitely go for an XP build. Like there is jellyfish and pug. Maybe I just like roll for those, because like we have a lot of money we could go for. Uh, no. <laughs> I could sell it, like, sell pigs, and then we can get close to leveling that, but I don't think I care too much. <laughs> so he came in to say, we've got a good class. Study hard, May. If you're still here to hear it. Please don't find a sloth in this weekly. I saw someone on the subreddit today. They found two sloths in the same run. Like, they had a <laughs> they had a sloth on their team, and they found another one in the shop. It is actually insane. Like, they are the chosen one. I'm rolling. I want to find XP. Hey, there's a level up too. Let's do this. Oh yeah, no, this works. Okay. So this will be like a, I don't even know, an 8-4 or something? 8-5. Somewhere around there. I don't think it's very good. But who knows? Maybe it'll trade well. <laughs> you found a slot in this weekly last night and it sucked. I found one in the last weekly, I think. Which also didn't have any ways to level up except for an alpaca. Which I did not have at the time, and I, <laughs> I died anyway. It was sad, though. This is background music for your programming. I respect it. That's still mostly how I use Twitch. I did watch the uh, Nintendo Direct earlier, though. No no Silk Song news. <laughs> it's so sad. I want to roll. I can do this, and it's like, it's okay. I don't know. Like, I could get either of these from Tier 3, which would be really nice. Which I actually probably do go for, because I'd rather find... I mean, I'd probably take this as well, because it is scaling, but... I'd rather find the XP stuff at this tier. Like, show me pugs, show me jellyfish. Jellyfish, thank you. Alright, I'm just gonna sell the beetle, I think. It's a pretty big, like, drop in stats, but... I can't sell the... <laughs> can't sell the pig yet. No. Too many. Uh, so we're probably going to lose here, and that's okay. I'm going to let them scale the carfish because I feel like that's the best thing on the team. Long term, at least. First off, I still haven't gotten a level 3 win. I have found many slots at this stage, and I have not have a, had a level 3 win either. And it is very sad. Hold on. I think I freeze this. I'd like some suit uh, salads as well if I get, like, to replace the pig and the giraffe. But for now, I think we just look for level ups for these three, and then I garlic whatever the biggest thing is. Alright, uh, let's just buy this. I feel like getting the the level up here is going to be more important than some of the other stuff. Now, I will get rid of the pig. I don't know if the salad's worth it. Like, the stats are okay. It's not that likely to hit the giraffe, but... <laughs> if we can just, like, roll three times and find some extra stuff, I think that's way more meaningful. I'm going to freeze it, but not buying. Fish is actually also kind of related there, but yeah, I'm going to do it like this. So I know we're only getting one level up here because like the blobfish isn't going to set anything over. I could maybe do that and maybe I should have gone like this instead, but I'm going to let it be like this. So this gets like all of the stats. It's going to be very big, <laughs> which is more helpful if it also has the garlic. Yeah, there we go. It doesn't trade incredibly well though. And Milky, hello. How are you doing? Hey, we did find another pug. 
I could maybe get rid of this then. Like, this is probably the team, even if we're going to sync with it. <laughs> I'd love to buy still some moles, like, more than the salad. I'm just gonna unfreeze. I think I, like, sell the giraffe. It's very... It's small, and we can't really afford to lose more HP at the moment. Okay, love that. Do I... I'm trying to decide whether I run this, like, separately. Because I could now do something like this. I'd probably move that further forward, so, like... I could do that. And then everything works, but then there's, like, less reason to have these separate. I think it's fine. I think I buy that. We continue rolling. I will freeze this. Can't buy it yet. Okay, this is huge. I don't know how this works, because I don't know if this pug is going to trigger first, because both my pugs have five attack. I'd rather the clownfish triggers before the jellyfish, because that saves us, like, 1-1 one, one in stats or something, I think. I think it's that. <laughs> I'm gonna do it like this again. I'm hoping this triggers first, but either way, I think we'll be okay. Do you ever consider game suggestions? Oh, hold on. I... My ears. Sorry, I just like touched my headset and must have like stroked the volume thing. I just like blasted myself. Oh god. Do I ever consider game suggestions? If so, I'd recommend Dome Keeper. I do consider game recommendations, but. Yeah, I'm not sure about Dome Keeper. It's, it's just a weird game that I haven't, like... I don't know, I haven't felt the urge to play, and the people that have, um... Like, the streamers I watch that play it, I haven't really watched much. I've just had it as, like, <laughs> background noise again. Anyway, we're definitely buying this. That That is happening. I don't care for Seal. We have an XP build. I think I just stack that there and then continue going. I think that's okay, honestly. Like, we do something with that. Uh, continue looking. I'd love to buy, sell a mole. I could maybe freeze, combine those. Assuming I can find, like, another one soon. Fish does work in a buy, sell... Not buy, sell, an XP build, but <laughs> I don't think it's that necessary. I guess I'll start freezing pairs as well, because I'm probably not buying anything else. Now, we can get two level ups by doing this. Or well, three, actually, because the ballfish will die and level the pug. Which seems pretty good to me. Send it. And Blue Note, Hello. Is this the weekly? It is indeed. I have remembered this time. And <laughs> got it right. Oh, those are almost terrible trades for us. But it worked out. We didn't get <laughs> didn't get too screwed over. Alright, I'm gonna combine there and honestly, I think I just buy sell mole, play the clownfish separately, and then maybe get the pair. I think it's okay. Alright. I'm going to let these two get the stats. I'm gonna play this, and honestly, I still don't know about the pair. Like, I <laughs> think I probably leave it. We need level ups way more than we need whatever else can possibly happen here. And I think this is just fine. If I just like put this behind there, then this all like works out pretty well. So, why that as it is, I don't care about this. And then send it like, yeah, send it like this. So we do get like two level ups here. Like this will level up. This will level up. That will be it. But it's still pretty good. Help. <laughs> it was wrong, Kalu. Uh, okay, we still trade. <laughs> I was worried. That was actually kind of a nice team uh, by them, though. Like, lots of fish. They're taking away your bus stop? They can do that? As in, they're just not going to stop at your bus stop anymore? Or they're literally removing the bus stop? Either way, <laughs> I'm very sorry. That does not sound fun. So, I'm wondering if I can wait for Melon here, because honestly, a lot of the things I have are very big. I could do this, but it's also probably staying right at the back, and then I don't know how, like, useful it is for me. I could do this, and we're likely to get some value, but not good value. Ah, no, I think I do buy it. Alright, take one of those. Let's roll. I'd love a cow, but I don't know if doing this does anything for us. I think this is also pretty good. Uh, I'll freeze cow. I'm just gonna roll three times though. All right. <laughs> All right. I think I do combine them. Like I think this is going to be okay for us. I'm gonna move that further back though. Like I just want that to not be right at the back because it feels like such a waste. Let's get this moment taking away the sign. They've been doing a lot of work around. Road work around. That is actually crazy. I don't know if I've seen like a bus stop get removed before, but haven't seen. Largish scale roadworks. Alright, doing this. Uh, keep scaling the clownfish. Yeah, keep scaling these two. I think that's fine. So I'm going to pump this. Do this. And 
Honestly, I'm probably still putting it on here. This is my favorite thing. <laughs> so I think that gets this. Then sell cow, buy clown fish, roll for more of them. More of any of them. All right. Uh, so, I could level up this now. It doesn't make it that much better than this clownfish, but it is something. I probably do still just do it like this then. Yeah, I think that's fine. Still very strange that we haven't found any <laughs> more jellyfish or blobfish. Interesting. Okay, well that doesn't kill us. We do get to punch all the way through. Hey, we got pepper value. The pepper actually saved us. <laughs> Which I wouldn't have bought it if I didn't think it might, but yeah. Alright, yeah. We're still not buying this. Oh, fine. The stats are too good. We're not selling anything. It's just it's just very cheap. And I did see the uh the Komodo. <laughs> it's not happening. Not with this. Alright, Tiger Pug is actually kind of interesting. I don't think it's very good. Especially with the build we have at the moment, it wouldn't really do anything, but it is a funny thought. Oh dude. Is this a mole? I think I buy some mole and end on zebra. Probably freeze lemon, uh, melon. Yeah, I'm gonna pump these two this time. I'm gonna buy this first before the melon, because <laughs> I'd rather have stats, even if it's not like the best play. Now, honestly, I probably just leave it like this. Like we still get two level ups this way. Is that or I do it this way, but then we still lose like one one. Yeah, I, I don't think I prefer this. We're, not, we're missing, like, A level there, but I think it's all good. For some reason, you've got a lot of milky instead of anything here names recently. I have literally been finding a ton of milky names as well. It's happened, like, three times this week. And I don't know if I'm just, like, singling them out because, like, I focus on them, but... Yeah, it's weird. <laughs> it's, I'm pretty sure I am just, like, noticing it more now, though. Uh, yeah, this is roll. I still want level ups more than, like, buying stuff. Yes. A thing. Another thing. It's going to be way harder to get that one, but <laughs> I probably still go for it anyway. Uh, everything stays the same, though. Give me the jellyfish. We've left the jellyfish at, like, level 1 for so long. We get, like, the in-game value, but, like, we could have been getting permanent stats on this for so long. <laughs> it just won't give it to me. You have no internet, so you're outside a free Wi-Fi spot for your... Balls, okay. Uh, yeah, we start with this. Just to see what it is. Tap it. Sure. It's it's probably the last turn. I could maybe get, like, popcorn for something. But everything's, like, very small. <laughs> Honestly, I'd probably rather put, uh, like, melon or pepper on there. I don't think... I don't think popcorn saves it much. But, yeah, we'll just... We'll just keep going. You know what? I should have bought the popcorn. Because this is probably the last turn, and I could have afforded it. But, yeah, let's just keep pumping this. Gonna take this as well. Uh, level ups. Level ups. Leaving the popcorn again. <laughs> I guess I will take that for my front line if we don't make it. So, I'm going to send it like... No, that's not the smarter way. It's annoying, because this is going to trigger first, but... Yeah. I think it's fine, because we do get this to level 3 this way, I think. Because it's going to be 2xp, 2xp. And this needs 4 to get to level 3. This will still trigger. It'll just trigger after the jellyfish. So we lose like 1-1 one, one from that, but we get more by getting an extra level up in the fight, so... I still think it's the right order. And do village, hello! Oh, hold on. They, like, destroyed all my equipment. Uh... Okay, we've lost. I don't think we're dead. Yeah, we have one more, one more go at this. So yeah, definitely doing this. I'd love to find the clownfish level up, like, naturally, but... Uh, like, do I... Do I just freeze popcorn? <laughs> just put popcorn on my pug at the back. I don't know if there's a better thing. Like, I don't know how many people are running uh, woodpecker pineapple here. Because if they, if lots of people are, then it's much better to just get like a lemon on something. But honestly, I think I just like freeze this and roll. See if there's like a sloth for me. <laughs> oh, well, there's those in the next life. All right. Hopefully this is the end. If there is another turn after this, then I don't know. We're not getting much stronger. Draconia! No, Draconis! Hello! <laughs> Tonky Tonkman, thank you for the six months! Happy to be here as always. Howdy, neighbor. Thank you. I'm glad you're happy to be here. And this is... This is death again. <laughs> very sad. Alright. Well, first XP build in a very long time, actually. But yeah, nine wins. Not bad. Is that Bugshot I just read? 
close. It was close, but it's all... It's all random. We could have won against some things, but... <laughs> apparently we went against... I don't know. I'm pretty sure I saw two llamas in the last two teams. I don't know if they were the same team or if there were just a lot of llamas around, but... Not llamas, alpacas. They're all the same. They look the same. I'm leaving the pig this time. <laughs> pig is not it. I think I take the chinchillas and I freeze the other one. And honestly, like, Moth Cockroach is a strat. I don't think it's a strat I'm going to push if I don't find both in the first, like, couple of things. Anyway, we'll be the edible pets. Let's do it. I'm quite late to the weekly. I know. I don't stream on Mondays, so... <laughs> the earliest I get to them is Wednesday. And I imagine a lot of people have already worked out something, and you know what? That is a level up. I'll take it. Alright, leave it like this, I guess. I don't know if we're going to win with this. It's not that strong for a turn 2 team. And we do, because <laughs> it's very strange. Who knows? Maybe they could have like got a draw if they had like good snipes. I doubt they could have got a win, but... Yeah, let's go. There, easy take. I'm also keeping these. There we go. Alright, leaving that, because I don't actually care about leveling this at all. I'm almost tempted to try and like pump something with loads of attack, but that would probably be the woodpecker. <laughs> don't even think it'd be a good idea. I think I just roll it. We need to find another chinchilla. And then just any decent tier twos. I think this is good enough to take. Oh, dude. <laughs> I don't even care that much, but like easy level up. Alright. Uh, do I care about like what gets the honey? I don't think so. I think I could just like... I might leave it like this, but honestly, this is all pretty good. I think there are sheep in the back as well. I may need to double check that. I don't know what I can get out of the spider, so maybe it's actually not that great. Hey, a draw. We take draws. What does the big spender roll do in Discord? It doesn't do anything. It's just a roll. I was thinking about what other sort of like rewards I could add. Don't forget to look for chinchillas. They don't have that weird star thingy. I'm hoping I haven't rolled past any, but thank you for the... A reminder there. Oh, dude, there are, like, decent things here. Like, Blobfish and Sheep are both pretty good. Bear is decent. It could, like, backfire a bit, but... That's three decent things. You can maybe get some Camel value, too, but... <laughs> I don't know if it's going to happen. Uh, I am tempted to sell it anyway, though, and run, like, double Peacock stack, because we might be able to get, like, a load of level ups. And if we can do that and find... Clownfish next turn, then we could do something amazing here. Alright. Yeah, I'm going to send it like that. Honestly, I may have been rolling chinchillas. <laughs> I don't have them in my head. Okay, this looks fine for us. Or jelly. Yeah, but jelly buffs itself. I'd rather get clownfish because it buffs these. And I'm tempted to sell something. So I can actually, like, if I do find... Hello. Hold on. Okay, let's, let's make room. I don't care about this one getting buffed, so I'll do it for the level up. Uh, we could whale bear, but it seems really janky. Hold on. So I'm doing this. I'm debating whether I buy the whale just for the bear, and then I want to hard roll for clownfish. And if I find one, I'd have to sell the whale or the bear. So I, I think I'm just going to hard roll for a clownfish, and I'm really hoping we can find one. Again, I don't care about the jellyfish. Like, it needs to be clownfish. I want to buff my peacocks. I don't care about, like, other stuff getting stats. There we go. <laughs> okay, uh, let's keep rolling. I could combine now, and it might be okay, but honestly, they probably don't need that much attack. Yeah, no, we can... Hold on. We roll first, but yeah. Don't care about any of that. We'll do one. All right, Rooster, don't care. It could be okay once we, like, level it up, but I don't know if this is a a summoning type of weekly. There are tapis, but they're not amazing. There is a vulture, but I don't feel like those are very good. I'm just going to leave it, I think. I want to find more clownfish. More clownfish, and then I can get, like, another couple of level ups here and have a super big peacock, possibly. Also, <laughs> that was not the right order for me, apparently. All right, at least we trade there, but we, we don't punch through. We buffed that thing up a lot. All right, yeah, don't care about more chinchillas. This is fine, but... <laughs> so, again, I can do this, and then I get the same thing. I'd rather look for tier fives, I think, because, like, a monkey, a seal... Maybe the shark could be, like, very early stuff to build off. So I'm going to play it here for now. I'm going to keep rolling, I think. Honestly, 
No, I'd rather garlic. Yeah, garlic's in the pack. And this is also amazing. Hold on. All right. We're going for big combinations next turn. We sell the bear. We stack that in there and then combine those two. And it'll be extremely big. And we'll get two tier fives. Assuming we have room. I'm not sure if... I think this slot might get filled up. Yeah, I'm going to send it like this for now. I don't want this right to the front, but... I don't want to feed as much. Oh, that's sad. Nah. That could have been okay for us. <laughs> Peacocks are actually like decent against these things if they're healthy enough, but they managed to destroy this thing's HP somehow. Alright, taking these, we are slapping that there. Shark is interesting, but I don't know. Okay, well that's a lot of stats. Uh... I don't even know, dude. I can't sell the clownfish. I could maybe combine them so they're less likely to get zebra or platypus buffs. I'm wondering whether I take the shark. Because like, there are summons, there's just not, like, great summons. <laughs> no, I don't think shark's it. Like, we can't even pill things. I'd rather skip it. Okay, I'm just going to buy this. Yeah, I'm, I'm combining it. Okay. Do this. I still don't... Oh, I guess I do take the shark. It's not... We don't have, like, synergy for it or anything, but let's just do this for now. Alright. So we have a bit of something here. Not amazing, but honestly, I think the peacock can carry for us, unless someone got an early scorpion. Uh, well, it, <laughs> it did a lot of work, but it didn't do as much as I wanted. No pills, don't take. I mean, it's still good to have on the team. I just can't, I can't like build a team around it because the summons aren't that good. There's no like amazing spam. Because like you could do like, you know, high level rooster tap here, but there's no turkeys or I don't know. I don't, I don't think having one like 50-50 thing at the back of your team is enough for a win. So what would I be looking for? Hawks? I just need like filler stuff this turn. I'll take like moles. Tempted to do this, but <laughs> I really don't care about that. I'd rather pass, and that is a level up. Hold on. Do we want a tier 5 or do we want a tier 6? I would like a tier 6, so I'm going to put that there. Uh, I'm not taking any of this though. Like We can get better stuff next turn. Oh dude, another one. We're probably keeping this. I may just like stack that there and then combine next turn. I think I'm okay with that. I'm not going to bother with mole plant this. Even if we do sell something, I do want to be rolling for other things, so... Yeah, gonna leave it like this. We're gonna have quite a big clownfish here. Long neck is a must for the giraffe. I think I have skipped many of those. It's early scaling, but like we already had, we had clownfish scale, which is my favorite. All right, I think, I think I leave this too. I'm debating whether I like sell shark, buy sell cow, pump the clownfish or the peacock some more and then see what my tier five is. I think I'm gonna do that. I don't want my, like, I don't want random stat food to go anywhere. Weird. Mine. Tap it. Again, I don't think I can use that well. Like, there are tap it scorpions, but there's no mushrooms. So I, I don't think it's great. Alright. Uh, yeah, I, I do pump this. It's going to be hard to get rid of. I doubt I'm getting rid of the clownfish for a long time either, but... Try and find two things. Scorpion is pretty good. It's okay to end on, at least. Yeah, I'll take that. And then I can roll. This is also okay. <laughs> Dude, this is, take this. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna leave this interaction. It doesn't actually level up the clownfish, but... You get less stats on the peacock. You get less stats here, and... Yeah, I, I doubt... If these are going to die, then they're going to die to, like... Start a battle snipes. I'd rather this get some extra stats on it, so... Send it like this. Hopefully it'll trade well. And crustaceans only. We did that, like, very recently, actually. No! <laughs> Having a blobfish actually might have saved that. It would have, like, tanked some of the shots, I think. I don't know if that had, like, weird stuff going on, but... Okay. We need to keep pumping this. I could put it on here, but I don't think I... I don't think I rely on scorpions that much. <laughs> I say as I take a third scorpion. <laughs> uh, cow. Hmm. I'm just gonna take cheese. Take cheese, put it on this. Send it again. We really need to pivot to tier sixes. I wouldn't have minded the monkey, but I don't know if we're in a place to get good use out of it. And honestly, I probably should have just bought like lemon for this. <laughs> I wanted melon, but like, yeah. 
Too greedy to wait. That is four trophies. And level two scorp. Yeah, it does nothing. They need to add a a reason to do that. Let me get the next one going. Just enabled again video and I can't... I don't understand what that means. But Terry, hello. Glad you could make it. The game did everything in its power to stop it. We actually had a great start though. Like the the clownfish peacock stuff was great. I just wanted to be greedy. Like lemon would have been okay, but I wanted to run it as a front line, which would mean would have meant lem uh, melon would be better because there's not actually a lot of actually I don't know. I guess there are there are some snipes, but for the most part, it's just like single big things. There's not a lot of summons in the pack that like I saw people using at least. All right, send it like that. We will be the tiny pieces. You're on mobile without video enabled. What? <laughs> Why? I never watch on mobile. It doesn't feel right. I'm actually going to take one of these. I usually don't buy bluebirds, but... Over the other things here, I, I think I'm fine taking one of those. And I shall do this. And rearrange a little bit. Oh, great hit as well. Favorite choice. <laughs> Alright, the mosquito stays for a while. Although it might not be, like, incredible, because there are a few uh, trigger things in the pack. I mean, it's like Microbe and Scorpion, they should get big stats on level up or something. They need to add something. Like, it doesn't need to make it OP. Just like you said, it could be something like the Doberman, where it's like, level up, gain 5-5. Five, five. Just, just something more than nothing. Because right now, there's actually no reason to combine unless you're just trying to get, like, a 1-1 one, one for 1 gold. Which isn't terrible value, but... Yeah, you don't want to have to push it. Camel, don't mind that. I'm not going to bother with salamanders, but I don't know, they may be decent. There's like three tier one, uh, two here? Or is that start battle? That's also one. I don't know, there's a few things. Salamander might be like doable, but I don't think I'm doing it this game. Alright, uh, anything here? Probably not. I could swap something out for bigger stats, but I don't think I care too much. Come on, better things. Uh, <laughs> fine. <laughs> I'll take one of those, then I'm rolling once more, probably swapping the beetle for something, and you know what? Let's just keep buying these. It probably means... Yeah, I should have sold the bluebird, because that's unlikely to get great value. Ooh, move that a little bit further forward, though. Yeah, see, that was a waste. How do you spend your balls now? What do you mean? The same way you always did. Alright. I guess I'm buying tabbies. This is like the fourth one I've seen or something. <laughs> I need to buy something with stats. Alright, we might be able to get some level ups, so I'll take one of these. It's just if I find a mosquito or something, like, hey. Alright, I'm gonna stack this. Let's put, like, honey on it, but I'd rather stack it. And then next turn, we combine and then combine again, and then we have a semi-big jellyfish and two tier fours. I'm hoping they'll be <laughs> respectable. But yeah, let's go. You mean redeems? I don't know what you mean though. Like the redeems are on, aren't they? I see them. Alright, well, here we go. Here are some stuff. Don't mind a horde. Yeah, these are both pretty good. I think we can maybe like. I mean, I can't yeet the jellyfish. <laughs> I think I get rid of the camel. Like, we're probably not going to be able to use that very well. I think this is good. I like the turtle as well, and throwing it in front of here would be fine, but... I don't... it doesn't scale well, and I don't think I care long term, so let's just do this. I'm going to leave jelly, because I'd rather find loads of stuff for the woodpecker. Like, we can find other things. Hmm. Roll once more. Alright. <laughs> That's fine, yeah. Snipe the back line. I don't really care where this hits. I feel like it might be better at the front early. Well, of course they have a frontline camel. <laughs> you got six trophies with an XP build, managed to get it to turn 14. Not bad. I'm a big fan of XP builds, I just haven't done them for a long time. Uh, we stack one of these? I'm wondering whether I like free Santa Ball roll once and then buy it. I don't know what else I do at this tier. I definitely want to wait for next tier to combine, so... Sure, let's do that. I actually don't mind where those hit. I feel like the jellyfish hit was like kind of a waste, but the temporary stats from this is kind of kind of nice. And you know what? You can be here. So it's like second position this time. Hopefully it'll actually do something. 
No Hawkeye. Hold on. Why did you just buy two blood donations? You took two damage every second with like zero regen and HP. I still don't know if I've ever taken one of those. And that's not because I like think they're bad or something. I just have never seen one in a build that would benefit from it. Like, I really have very, like, tanky builds. For the most part, I just go for, like, glass cannons. <laughs> Alright. Uh, seal. Honestly, I don't have much of anything else going on at the moment, so I may take that, like... I don't know about the worm, but I think a seal's pretty good. I can maybe swap this. Or the tabby cap. I still want the combo. Let's get rid of the jellyfish. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna roll for pears. I don't care about worm. We found one pear. Alright. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna do this, then. Uh, I mean, those stats kind of sucked, but my, my goal is to get the seal big. I care less about the other stuff it might hit. Oh, dude, that woodpecker. <laughs> it, like, killed, like, three quarters of his team. Amazing stuff. I think Tabby Cat would be actually used if they changed it to permanent stats and, and a tier 5. I mean, that's the thing. It has decent stats for a tier 2, but I don't care about its ability. It's the same reason why I don't like the Ladybug. Like, I don't want to have to be buying food every turn, and if I am, then I want more value out of it. Like, I want seal and cat value instead of <laughs> just this. Like, it's not even just buy food. It's This has to eat the food, and you get, like, a very mild benefit out of it. Like, I, I don't care. Might do this for a bit. Like, <laughs> we're just looking for, like, seals after this. Yeah, no, there's, like, really nothing I'm looking for here. Like, it's just the tabby cat. I'm just going to feed this and get some stats on the team. All right. Send it again. Hopefully it'll do something. It's like my first time <laughs> putting this on a mosquito too. In a long time is what I mean. Very rarely do that. Turns out that the bus you need no longer goes through the stop. Oh god. That does not sound great. Alright. I want seals. Show me seals, stew, and lemon? I mean, a pair is fine, but I need to, like, get rid of things. I think this hawk is, like, default stats. I'm just going to sell that just to prompt myself to buy something else. The mole is okay, but I really need to find other things this turn. I need a second seal. I mean, sure. Look, that's a level up. We take a level up. Honestly, I probably take a lioness, too. It's been a long time since I've tried a lioness on the squad, so <laughs> let's go with that. I'm just going to unfreeze there. I'd rather find, uh, find leopards. What am I saying? There's stew. Stew and lemons. I'm wondering if I can even use this, though. Like, I probably sell the lioness to get the zebra, but then like, why even have this on the team? Who knows? I think I freeze. Maybe she should just sleep at the office. Don't say that. No one should have to do that. 2 HP. 2 HP. Oh, God. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think we just sell this. Is that or I sell something else, but like... I don't even know. Like, this tabby cat ability just doesn't matter. But like, this is so much... <laughs> like, this has a more useful ability. And we get more gold out of it this way. Like, this is... Let's do this. I'm gonna freeze this dude, but not buy it straight away. Come on, give me something better. Okay, another seal, and I can afford it. I do see the mole. I do not care. We hit one of the seals. I'm gonna say good enough. <laughs> it's probably not good enough. We are probably dead, but whatever it takes. We got a we got to believe again at least. And yeah, I don't know if we make it through this. <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to think that like frontline massive camel may be the play, because I'm seeing just non-stop snipes in these builds, including my own. But like, yeah, seems like a decent strat this weekly. All right, we made it to six. I feel like Lioness never works because tier 6 is just too late to pivot. I think it's fine as a thing that you just like throw on your team for a couple of turns. In that case, it was a turn or two too long, but yeah, I think it can be okay. I just, like you said, it's just very late. Uh, let's get the magical smartphones. Like that the anime slash manga thing that I've never actually seen. Alright, there we go. Another team with only two things at the start. I swear these things are bots. <laughs> there can't be this many people running, like, teams like this. And you know what? No, I'm not going to greed. Alright. So, send it like this. 
Perfect. Oh, pretty good as well. As good as if one of them had hit this. So I don't, I don't mind that. We got some value. And we didn't lose. Perfect. If only you can run, run into that team with the Scorps. <laughs> the one I just ran into? Oh no, the camel one. Yeah. I definitely agree. Alright. Uh, we're combining. We have like loads of combos. I could roll for a jellyfish first maybe, but... Uh, let's roll like once or twice. Nothing. Okay, let's combine them. Alright, clownfish. Perfect. Excellent stuff. Seagull. <laughs> I mean... I could take it. I could like give it garlic or something. Although I can't even do that yet. I think I do take it. I don't think it's that incredible. <laughs> it's too many. I don't want these. This is very big, so maybe I do try and pump the mosquito some more, but like, yeah. And I'm not taking a jellyfish. We don't have more levels anymore, so. Send it how it is. I actually like my order now that this got buffed. <laughs> it got saved. Yeah, yeah I, I don't think we were going to punch through the very scary front line. So I probably slap that straight on because I really don't want it to get hit by the bluebird. And then let's roll this. Dude. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to think how I do this. Like, maybe I just put, like, croissant on the seagull and then play mosquito. Yeah, that does something. <laughs> Alright. And honestly, I'm combining again. Like, I want permanent stats on here. It means we're more likely to, like, get a hit on something useful with the bluebird and this thing actually starts scaling, so. Slightly weaker this turn, but, you know, more of a greed play. We do a poll to see if you're homeless tonight. What is that? Wait, Kelly, do you mean you can't get home? Oh god, yeah, that is what you mean. Oh, I had it like completely backwards. For some reason I thought you meant you couldn't get to work, but it's like so late. <laughs> yeah, we don't want this. We need tier threes. I do see like, you know, XP stuff. <laughs> there is no reason not to do this. Alright. Wowee, a platypus. <laughs> Yeah, very much do not care about that. I'm I'm letting this stay where it is. I could freeze a garlic, but if we really need it, we'll find one later. Yeah, this... this <laughs> the attack on my front line just means nothing. Like, we're stomping through everything. Fine, look, I guess we are just an XP build again. <laughs> Alright. I'm playing it separately. Dude, huge. Absolutely huge, and I'm doing it now. Do not care about the whale, though. I do see whale blobfish, and there's, like, something to say about that. I mean, we could get two level ups out of that. It's definitely better than the seagull. I actually might take that for now. So, I don't know how big this is by default. But we will be losing some stats, but I think the stats we get from the clownfish are going to massively... Just, just mean a lot more for us, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, and I can't be bothered with this. You get your croissant, you don't get a pineapple. And Suboptimal, hello! Welcome, Raiders. How's everyone doing? <laughs> Did you guys do anything interesting? Alright, hold on. Uh, I'm wondering whether I, like, combine all these. I do need to make room, and we are at tier 4 now. Yeah, I guess I just do, like... No reason not to. Hamster, it's like a free buy. <laughs> sure, why not? I'll take it for a bit. Maybe we'll get some value out of it. I will have to move it like this or something to get better value out of the blobfish, but this is still working. Freeze a pair, maybe? Now, I'm wondering, because if I roll, I'm really only looking for, like, more blobfish. Blobfish and clownfish, I mean. There's not a lot of tier 4 that I want. So maybe just, like, do this. I want to keep this for a long time. So I'm going to send it like that, and I'm going to get another turn sailor out of the hamster. You did some meme games, was great. Meme games. What sort of memes? I need ideas. <laughs> I haven't decided what view lobbies are doing. And it died to 1 HP again. To Jesus fish. Alright. Yeah, yeah, we roll. We roll twice, and then I'm probably selling the hamster, because I see no reason for this to be on the team this long. Uh, This is just, this just not it. I don't know what I'm meant to do with this team. I need to find, like, lemon next turn. I'm not going to buy garlic. Like, we need... We need different stuff. Yeah, we're going to sell the hamster, but I need to find something worth replacing it. I 
like enemy hurts. I could like swap that in so we get some value out of the mosquito maybe. Replace some equipment. I have been avoiding these because I didn't want to take it, but <laughs> starting to feel like I might need it. Nah, fine. You can have that then. And send it again. We might be able to get some extra triggers out of it as well. It's very unlikely, but if this can like survive some hits, then it might be able to give stuff weakness by itself. Hey. You're freezing and I'm mobile. You <laughs> have compassion on me. I hope you're okay, Kalu. Get home safe, okay? Yeah, no, we need best things. There are tier 5 equipments that can actually, like, protect us a bit. <laughs> it's not that. I don't want Shark either. I know there's, like, some synergy, but the Whale was, like, a meme pick. It's not even that good. Well, like, Lionfish is okay. Any sort of, like, Scalers might be okay as well. I can maybe put it there. <laughs> this is dumb. Why would I do this? I don't want to do this. I'd rather, like, buy a Rhino and put it behind the Blobfish. And then I'd need to, like, throw Frontline Whale. <laughs> If I don't just get rid of it. Choose the Kalu hat. Oh, the bear hat. Hold on. There it is. Excellent choice. Commit to whale. The whale's so bad, though. And you're a doubter. You don't get to tell me what to do. Alright. Honestly, I think the rhino might be, like, a better play. If I could do, like, rhino pepper, maybe. But I don't know how... <laughs> I don't even know... Everything just seems so bad. I'm going to go Rhino Pepper. If I can find it anyway. I'm going to leave that and hope I can find something better. Uh, we didn't. I'll freeze this. And I'm not buying garlic. We need, like, lemon if we're doing this. <laughs> yeah, no. That's, that's not going to happen. Where's the tier 5 equipment? Oh, God. We're, at, we're so dead. <laughs> it's, it's just going to happen. And Frisbee, Hello. You should start like a challenge series like pack one, but after every fight you must attempt to buy one of the opponent's pets. That sounds very... I doubt I'd be able to keep up with it very well. I wish, but I don't know. Yeah, we're not leveling the Clownfish either. It's going to be too difficult. Uh, Lionfish with the Blobfish is interesting, but I doubt we could ever get any good value out of it, because by the time it gets leveled up, it's going to be the front line. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm not touching any of this. So I like, do take these. I don't even know. We do get, like, some extra value. Sure. <laughs> and there's another one. i probably just buy it. We still haven't seen any equipment, and, like, rolling three times isn't going to make us any stronger this turn, so... Yeah. I'm just gonna combine here. Not gonna bother with the monkey. Do this. Send it. If we die, we're dead. Like, I have nothing to say. How do you turn off all catches on Twitch on iOS? I wouldn't know. I never watch Twitch on uh, phones. I'm a PC only lad. I do scroll like social media stuff on my phone, but I never like watch anything. YouTube or Twitch. Hope the Rhino gets to do something weekly. Is very few summons. I know, but it's still like a fairly big thing. Reindeer would definitely be better. And I think we do swap it out now that we have something better. <laughs> I'm doing that instead of combining these. Can't use the lemon anymore. Like, I could throw it on here maybe, but it's not actually... I don't know, it doesn't do anything. It's so top-heavy. Like, Pepper would be a lot better, I think. And I, just, I don't know if I've seen any of that. No, we don't need this. Uh, look, sure. I need something. I could put it on there. I think I could throw it on here, though. I might throw it further forward, though. And Tiger Reindeer. Genius strats. Alright. Uh, how can we do this, then? Like this? No, because I definitely need it behind the Reindeer. Because I need, I need this interaction. So I guess this is still the order. Alright, sure. Obviously, I could do, like, blobfish smaller. Smaller clownfish? Also, dude. <laughs> we sniped the scorpion, so his whale ate the rhino. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect planning. <laughs> Alright. I think I'm stacking here. I know I lose a tier 6, but I'd rather not have to buy a salad bowl just to have something. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to buy this. And I still don't think it's worth taking a tiger yet. I think I just roll and hope to find something. Because we get like two rolls for it. And you know what? I'm okay with this. I am okay with this. Just stay big. Stay big. Stay safe. Hmm. Liking the weekly so far? I don't think I've done that well. We had a nine win. But I've only, I've only played a few runs so far. 
<laughs> I'm still trying to work it out. It seems like there's a lot of spammy... There's a lot of small spammy snipes, and I keep running into stuff like this, where it's just a massive frontline camel. Kind of sad. This is also going to, like, break me. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that was so close. We're still not taking this. None of this does anything for me. Like, that needs pepper as well. We need to find pepper. I could start... I mean, like, to be fair, I could have, like, a chain. <laughs> I could sell cow through blobfish where this is. And we could, like, level up two things, get, like, a fair amount of stats. I don't mind that. But I really want to find more of these. I'm going to leave the cow. Show me more reindeer. I want to level stuff up. Or peppers. It's not a pepper, but... Maybe it'll survive? <laughs> I hope so. Alright, yeah. We render like this, then. It's a bit janky, but it's kind of getting somewhat. You actually won a prediction today. I'm very happy for you. Oh, my my thing died. Oh. They sniped it. Okay. <laughs> we still drew. Finally, one of these. I think I actually just throw it here. This is more to pop equipment than to do damage. Like, I don't think the extra six damage from the pineapple is worth much. I think this can trade much better. It does depend if they have frontline snipey stuff, but... Overall, I think that is a better play. I will take one of these. And I don't think soft ice is it. I think I keep rolling. I need to find a blobfish or a reindeer upgrade. Like, I would like either very much. But I'm trusting this. I trust that this can work. The red turn 13 blobfish par- Wait, blobfish chain pivot? It's not much of a pivot. Oh, this is bad though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're dead. Alright. Seven trophies, though. We made something happen. I was so hoping we could get another level up on this. Like, if we could get, like, two more two more reindeers and another blobfish, then we could have had a level three there. Would have been very nice. But... Believe a payout, all the same. <laughs> Small victories. And yeah, see, see a late firehead, if I haven't already said. So I did, like, read it, but I can't remember if I read it out loud. Uh, let's keep going, then. I'll do this until, like... At the very least, the end of the hour. But I'll probably go like for a few runs after that and maybe switch over to one of the other ones for the last half hour. And that must be the dancing heads because I'm lazy and can't think of something better. Nice hats, dude. <laughs> so 10 more minutes. At least 10 more minutes. I don't know. Uh, I really don't want any of this, but I'd rather save... No, because I do have to sell, because I'd have to combine anyway, because, yeah. Alright, we roll <laughs> at least once more. You know what, I'm just running a three squad, I think. Or a five squad. I'm just going to wait for one more thing. And it all sucks! Where are the things? What the hell? Why, could, why couldn't we find any combos? Or any, like... Well, yeah, basically a combo. <laughs> I just wanted one more. One more of anything. Okay. So yeah, I'm going for this level up. We're not buying these ladybugs. And I doubt I'm buying the shrimp for all these cells because I don't care about the stuff I have. Let's just sell these. Combine it and then start looking. Alright, that's not bad. I don't know if Wombat's any good. I feel like it's not. I don't think I've been seeing many death rattle things other than Blobfish and that's been me. <laughs> yeah, no, this, this doesn't really appeal to me. Alright, Peacock, not bad. We can take one of those. There is a chinchilla, assuming I haven't, like, skipped any others. Uh, I'm actually going to double sell here. Let's get double this going for a minute, and I will combine now, because we do get stronger for it, right? Yeah, we get, like, two, two more. So I waste one gold by doing it now, but I think it's worth potentially not dying. All right, Woodpecker, excellent get, big fan. And send it like this. Uh, we're okay here. Yeah, there we go. Alright, anything that keeps us safe. And we'll definitely be taking this. I don't care about keeping the chinchilla anymore. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the jellyfish. I don't think we're investing in here at all. Let's just keep looking. I, I do really want a jellyfish. I, want, I don't even know. What do I want? This? So it triggers first, but it's more like... <laughs> more dodgy? Maybe it'll like trade better. It does make it a lot weaker going against other woodpeckers, but hey, it made it trade! It actually made it trade, and I think that won us the fight. 
I like the games like Hades or Rift Breaker. Hades, yes. Rift Breaker, I'm not sure if I've heard of it. I was thinking about playing a game called... Oh, I'd have to check it again. It's it's like a snake game. S... Oh, I don't know. I'd have to find it. Hold on. Let's see. Where's my Steam profile? It's like snakes. S-N-K-R-X. Yeah, that one. <laughs> it's, it's like a roguelike thing. <laughs> S-N-Q-R-X. Good enough, yeah. They should change that. Is The branding's annoying. <laughs> I, want, I want to know how to say it. Alright. Honestly, I probably do take this because it is an improvement if I find another one of those or combine maybe. I think a giraffe is okay. I think I... Hold on. Let's do this. Freeze this. I'm going to roll twice because if you find a... Oh, these are all great. Hold on. Hold on. Alright. <laughs> That's too many. We don't need this many giraffes. What I do want to find is a... The thing, the thing that this guy wants. But yeah, I'm going to keep buffing this. The woodpecker stays on the team, I think. Unless we do try and pivot to weird camel stuff, but I don't want to have to do that. And yeah, these are very unfortunate trades. It's a good one. I played a little this morning, and it is, it is really fun. Oh, you know what? We can do, like, both of these, maybe. Hold on. I'm going to do the combo now, because I'm going to have to sell something anyway. I think... I think we get rid of the blobfish before we get rid of the jellyfish. I know that means we don't get, like, synergy stuff on this turn, but... <laughs> I doubt I'm doing woodpecker. I could do woodpecker, camel, armadillo. That seems like the biggest meme ever, though. Like, this. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Oh, on top of all of your riveting stories, you're now at 10% battery on your mobile. So you have to do the wise thing and leave. Get home safe, Kalu. I hope it's not too cold for you. See you later, and thanks for the help. Yeah, I'm getting rid of this. Getting rid of this. I think I definitely take this. And I will run it that way, at least. But I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what else I do. You know what? Yeah, let's just, like, go all in. All right. Uh, so we have this. <laughs> all right. It's going to be awkward, but I think, like, every other turn, I, like, swap these around or something so we get some stats on them. And that is, that is bad for us. Very scary stuff. By the way, this is probably throwing, because I don't actually know how to use any of these, like, in combination. Uh, again, garlic's fine. We're obviously not doing this anymore. Yeah, I probably do need to take a garlic. Otherwise, I'm too afraid I'm just going to insta-die. Yes, I'll freeze both of these. And... I'm going to leave stuff where it is. Like, I could put this at the front, but then we don't have the... The funny synergy. <laughs> Massacre Steam? Yeah. It's a Massacre Steam that doesn't have an elephant. Hey, we got some value. We're still going to die, but... Oh, we traded. We traded. Hold on. Okay. Uh, definitely buying this. Honestly, I probably just pumped this, because this is going to be more important than the Armadillo, even though Armadillo is a higher tier thing. <laughs> that is a... That is a level up. I don't even know. I want to get a tier 6. I think this turn, I just, like, buy this. I could put it here, but I doubt we're going to get great value out of that. So I'm going to let it run like this. We'll get a tier 6, and then, honestly, I'm probably going to sell it again. It's not getting much value, like, in the battles, and it doesn't really do that much by itself, so... <laughs> Team go burr. I hope it does. Oh, monkey. Actual scaling. Hold on. Reindeer! That is something to scale. Hold on. Alright. Uh, I may just, like, ditch the armadillo. Oh, this is so awkward. Unless I ditch the woodpecker. <laughs> but it's so big. The problem is, I don't want to buff the woodpecker. Like, buffing a reindeer is cool. But I can't get rid of the draft. Like, it's also good scaling. The armadillo is the worst thing. Then I don't know where to put this. I'd have to, like, run it like that. And then I'm, like, adding a giraffe for no reason. Oh, god. Alright. Yeah, I think I get rid of this. I think I need these two. And I could freeze a pair, maybe, but lemon on here means a lot. Uh, just getting level ups is pretty cool as well. Just roll a bit. All right, that's nice. Didn't find any more monkeys. I will leave it like this, though. Like, out of the things I want buffed, it is these two. And we do get, like, one trigger out of the camel. So, <laughs> there's still some reason to keep the woodpecker. Kind of wish I could put those the other way around, though. I'd much rather the, the reindeer get super big. 
And hey, that triggered first, so it didn't like destroy. Oh, that's no, before attack. Never mind, we lost our HP again. You just saw a guy who had a sloth on his team on the weekly. You feel sorry for him? That was me last week. I had one very recently, and it was also on the weekly. <laughs> Sad times. Dude, I think we get rid of the woodpecker. Like, we can do tiger camel here. Like, that has to be better. Alright, let's buff these two. And do this. Alright, so how does this work? We're buffing the reindeer. We get twice the camel triggers, and we're buffing camel tiger. I think that is okay. We could probably get rid of the reindeer soon, but... The rest of this, I think, is as good as we can get. <laughs> I just need to hope we can get some, like, reindeer level ups and keep scaling it a bit. Dude, excellent value again. Amazing stuff. And we got weakness, but, like, it's good. <laughs> it's actually working. Alright, uh, I don't know if we buy that. It's like half a pair, but I doubt we... Actually, I doubt we can pivot off it, so maybe we do buy that. I'd much rather scale the reindeer, though. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I almost said to take, like, Komodos, but... Alright, I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna leave pair. I'll take another one. Okay. Now, the choice is, do I take a cupcake or do I roll three times? I am not going to greed. For the believers. For the believers, I'll do that. <laughs> if we die, then whatever. They check the archive of sloth losses. No, oh, there are too many. I mean, yeah, we're destroyed. Alright, fair enough. Overall, pretty bad team. <laughs> the scaling just... It just wasn't there. Alright, five trophies. Good effort, but not a believer game. So let me pay that one out. Alright, it is the app. I'm going to do a couple more of these. Makes you remember when you first got a sloth and got zero wins. I don't know if I've had... Oh, dude! <laughs> it's perfect! The dream! Uh, kind of tempted to buy shrimp. I really wish we had broccoli instead of... Sh not shrimp, this, the peach. But I probably roll for more, like... We have a moth level up, maybe I go for a level 3, though. Look at the shy bamboos. But yeah, I've had bad sloth games. I don't know if I've had zero wins, but I've had... I've had games where I've, like, found a sloth and then lost every round following it. <laughs> Alright. Uh, is this where I rolled three times for another cockroach? Which I'm pretty tempted to do, because, honestly, we're probably keeping cockroach moth for a long time. The peach is very useful, but if we can get the level up... Dude, we already found it. It's actually insane. This is a really bad team, by the way, but it's... We have level ups. Oh, dude. Dude, we trades! Oh, damn. You've been binging all of your YouTube videos. Super happy to catch you live. <laughs> Lean, welcome. Glad you could make it. And you've never found a sloth. How long have you been playing for? Because I have, like... I'm, like, nearing 500 hours in the game. I'm pretty sure I do have 500 if I'm counting... Uh, whatever it's called. Yeah, I don't know what it's called. The online thing. The test server. Yeah, that's a lot of time. I still think I've had, like, better than average luck, though. Got, like, 90 hours in it. Yeah, I think that's probably bad luck, then. I found my first one after 160 hours, but then I've had some periods where I found, like, a sloth within, like, five hours of each other. <laughs> so, yeah, it, it varies a lot. Uh, I don't think I'm taking any of this. Like, Toad's cool, but kind of gets messed with the bear. I'm gonna leave it. All right. Uh, panda cockroach? There's some synergy there. Dude, we could do, like, fried shrimp panda shenanigans. <laughs> it's not even good, but I'm doing it. I do have my moths going on the bear, but I think I'm okay with that, because this thing is, like... I thought, I thought that'd be better. But then it was, like, 1 HP bad difference. Alright, I'm taking this. It's not worth doing if we don't have a level up yet. <laughs> No, just unfreeze these. We keep rolling. We need moths, cockroaches, or pandas. Any of that is appreciated. We didn't find any. I will still leave it like this, though. Again, if anything's getting the attack from the moths, then it should be this. It's the most bottom-heavy thing we have. Even if it's not getting, like, multiple trades. Ah, shit. 100 hours of sap. Wait, with only regular ship. Sap, you found five slots. See, that's, like, really good. Like, <laughs> I'm jealous. We just get rid of this. I don't know what's going to happen, but like, that's not doing any work for us. 
could freeze that maybe. Dude, level up. I think we just do it now and then freeze whoever comes out. Alright, rooster. Oh god, it's not good though. <laughs> How do you use a rooster in this? I know I've seen someone with a good rooster build, but I can't remember what they had. I think it was just a big rooster, so I, I don't know. I think we do look for other things. I need to buff up something else. And I'm not doing Aardvark there. <laughs> it's, it's just not strong. Alright. Check the archives of True Believers. I Why is the next bit anyway? Out of all of them, only one has gone above four wins. Ouch. I don't know. My my games have been like terrible. I need to roll. I need to get level ups, and like I don't even want it to be these that badly anymore. Woodpeck is fine, but again, it's just like I'm hard counted if I run against um like camel stuff. Like if I was doing a camel, then sure. I don't even know what I'd go for on the next tier. Like hawks are okay. Well, maybe there's definitely food build stuff in here. I'll take this for now. I doubt I'm sticking with it. That does help a little bit. Yeah, okay. We're looking for tier fours. I don't think I'm investing too much. But Advark with bear honey. Yeah, but it's not actually it's not actually a good combo. I've tried it so many times and it's just it's not worth it. Like it's it's okay, but that's as good as it goes. Alright, so I do see worm, but like it have to be pears really. Like I can buy fried shrimp. And maybe get a pepper next turn. We can try it. I don't know, maybe I do get rid of the moth first. I think not the moth, this guy. Uh I think You know what? Let's just go a bit crazy here. <laughs> I'm gonna do this. Those are the only two things that I like want to keep on the team. I will rearrange those things soon. Let's leave that for a bit. I need to see if I can find more worms or any pears. I'm not going for that anymore. It's it's too late. <laughs> this isn't good either. Oh god, alright. Uh, you know what? Lynx then. Maybe Lynx is something that can save us. Okay, I'll give it to you now. I'm just gonna run it like this. Worm moment. Yeah, like, it seems like this could be okay for a food build, but also we're, like, about to die. So I don't think this is the run for it. Yeah. It's not good. Need strong rat bear for Aardvark to go off, and even then the other team has a rooster, you're dead. Well, that, it's just, it's just not good. Like, the stats you get from it aren't enough to make up for just, <laughs> just bad stuff on your team. You need to force it so hard, and I don't feel like it actually, like, pays out very often. And honestly, I'm getting rid of the worm. <laughs> I know I just bought it. Let's try and make this work, maybe. It's such a mess, though. No llama. Look, fine. Fine, I'll take it. I'll take it. Are you happy now? Will you save my run? <laughs> this is the kind of run you get to slop on. This is just, like, going down the drain. Like, I don't feel like there's much point in trying to save it. Yeah, there we go. Like, unless we found a load of level up so we could get, like, massive value out of this, then we just had, like, nothing on the team. Nothing had much HP, so, like, we couldn't get good value out of the moths because everything just, like, traded with whatever the front line of the enemy team was. So, yeah, it was bad. Hold on, prediction? No. Oh. 